Welcome to the Galapagos. The Galapagos Islands are a unique and very special set of islands, 1,000 kilometers from Ecuador and the South American mainland. The 13 islands and seven small islands that make up the Galapagos were formed two million years ago by the underwater volcanoes in the sea. Since then, a wide range of strange and wonderful plants and animals have grown and evolved on the islands, far away from other life in South America. Some of the creatures to evolve and grow on the islands are the marine iguana, the Galapagos sea lion, the smallest sea lion in the world, and the giant Galapagos tortoise. So what can we learn from these amazing creatures? Let's find out, shall we? This is a giant tortoise. They're only found in this part of the world on the Galapagos Islands. Now this guy here, he might weigh almost as much as a car, and he's probably about 100 years old. Now they're often described as nature's bulldozers, so as they walk, they actually break down a lot of vegetation. They uh, break away through trees and branches. But what they do is they actually lay their own poo on the way. Now in this poo is full of all the seeds and all the plants that they've eaten. And as they knock down old trees and old plants, they replant new ones on the way. So they're not really a bulldozer, because a bulldozer destroys. A giant tortoise creates. A tortoise's poo is rich with nutrients, seeds and moisture, making each plop a perfect compost for plants to grow. These plants are then eaten by giant tortoises and other animals, creating a cycle of life on the islands. Now these giant tortoises used to be found on every continent on the planet. They used to be in Europe, they used to be in Africa, they used to be in Asia, they used to be across all of North and South America. But for a combination of climate change, hunting, and just going extinct. The only place you can now find these giant tortoises are on the Galapagos Islands and the Seychelles. Two little islands where you can only find these amazing animals. There used to be 14 different species of Galapagos tortoise. However, now there's only 10. Luckily, thanks to the work of the Charles Darwin Research Centre, they're helping to reintroduce this amazing creature back into the wild. Scientists and volunteers from the Charles Darwin Research Centre have worked hard to help protect the giant tortoises in the wild. And by keeping checks of the tortoises, as well as teaching locals and tourists about how to protect them, the number of giant tortoises has continued to grow. But the Galapagos giant tortoises are still at risk from traffic and other dangers introduced to the islands. Like many creatures on the Galapagos, the giant tortoise are unique and special to these islands. The Galapagos is a wonderful and amazing place full of fantastic and one-of-a-kind animals. The things here cannot be found anywhere else in the world, which makes the Galapagos Islands so special. And it will continue to be that special as long as we remember to look after it. So until next time, bye.